We are at Cedar Ridge Park on Belton Lake. What's up, YouTube? Dude RV. We're headed down into the hill country, the Texas hill country. We decided we just wanted to do a short drive today, two hours or so. We are at Cedar Ridge Park on Belton Lake. It's a COE property. It's actually a very big park, but I have just been informed that half of the park is closed. This half is closed due to construction, so we're not gonna get to check that out on this journey. So I guess we'll be making a return visit to Cedar Ridge Park in the future. But anyway, let's hop on the scooter and go for a ride and see what we can see. All right, got the scooter, got the GoPro, and I got you. So let's go check out Cedar Ridge Park on Belton Lake. Get off the curb. There we go. All right. I have to edit that out. All right, apparently there's a crazy Tom turkey here at the gate. He might chase us as we go by. There he is right there. When we rolled into Cedar Ridge Park, uh, we saw at least a dozen white-tailed deer. And according to the pictures I've seen on Google guides, there's quite a few in this park. It's not unusual to see them. But the terrain here reminds me a lot of Mother Neff State Park. And many other places down in the hill country. But we're not too, actually not too far from Mother Neff State Park, so it's no wonder that it reminds me of Mother Neff State Park. Now, one of the park hosts that I was visiting with, he said that uh, this is an extremely busy park during the summer. We're not too far from Temple or Waco. Had a conversation with a local who camps down here regularly. So it's a great fishing lake. If you can get to the water. There's a lot of cliffs along the shoreline. And oh, by the way, we're still having issues with Little Red. Hopefully, you'll need to stay tuned because I'm going to have someone, a subscriber is actually going to help me out and work on Little Red. That'll be several videos out, but we're headed down to see him at Garner State Park. It is December 26, 2019. The temperature's in the low 60s. We got rain in the forecast for the next couple of days. We're gonna run all the way down to the end of the road and come back to the RV loop here. dump station.
just a beautiful weather. I know you folks up north are wishing you could go camping too. Looks like that group of pavilion is closed. We won't be able to ride through there. Private residence back right up to the park here. I suppose they're not too unhappy that that pavilion is closed. Let's go see the marina and the turkey roost and the screen shelters. And we'll come back to the boat ramp. This is where we saw the deer. So we were told that our site was occupied when we got here. And so we came in here to the group meeting area, the turkey roost group meeting area part so the ratty pack could do their business. And there were deer all over out here. Could you get a big family reunion or a micro rally or something that you're gonna do? This looks like a fun place to set up camp. Got a great big covered pavilion there. Big barbecue grills and volleyball net. Every site's got its own power of water, higher range. Looks like that's gonna be a bit of a downhill run to get to the marina. Going down's okay. Coming back up is the hard part. at a time go to the screen show the roof's kind of rough Just to pop in and take a look at them. Moving right along. Going through the screen shelter loop. Cedar Ridge Park on Belton Lake. I oh, mean, that's a that's a photo op right there. The road is 
kind of rough. Oh, what you got right there? We're gonna we're gonna take a picture. Well, alrighty then. We got a steep hill to climb. Boat high and dry. It's a long way from the water. see the deer back up in the brush but uh i know that if i turn the camera on them you won't be able to see them to the marina. According to those signs, you don't want to be down here without a permit. Parking. That's gonna be a that's gonna be a hill to come back up for sure. back up the hill. there. Yep, we got to put in a new bag. So we're going to have a momentary pause in production. All right. Battery swap complete. We are 
running again. We're going to take a look at the boat ramp. You don't have to have a special permit to visit. coming back up. Don't have enough width there to do the switch back. You can see that truck making the boat now. Sunset Pavilion on the scooter, they got her locked down tight. So if you're out here at Cedar Ridge Park, you might want to do a family reunion. A nice big pavilion here. There's several pavilions. Horseshoe pit. Volleyball net. Very rough. Very, very rough. Doesn't look like they've been used very much. All right, now we gotta get out of here. So to get out of here, we gotta go back over to the restroom. We gotta go off road.
tour the RV loop. Kid camping is on the other side where they've got the construction going on. All of the camping loops require a gate code to get in with a vehicle. As you can see, it's not like super secure. back up the other way. Tell how bumpy these roads are by the amount of rat coming from my extra battery. All the bikes are very spacious, but they're really close together. Not a lot of screening. going to Valadero Canyon or most of our state park. So anyway, we'll go back here to camp, close it up. Those are always so much fun. Uh, let me give you the great backdrop shot. There you go. There's the one. Hey, if this is your first time to visit Dude RV, remember to click on that subscribe button down there and remember to hit the bell as well. That way you'll never miss another production from Dude RV. On this journey, we're actually picking up five new parks. Four of those are Texas state parks. So you're gonna wanna come along for the ride. For those of you who have been riding along with me, thank you so much. I'm very honored. We hit 10,000 Thanksgiving weekend, and, and I owe you for that. Thank you so very much for helping me to get to that point. Last thing I got to say is, y'all come back now, you hear? <laughs>